this is Mike with Extreme Audio. Here we have a quick demo of a remote start system installed on a 2014 Lexus GS350 using the OEM key fobs and drone mobile. This is one of our most popular combinations because it gives you up close starting without needing an additional remote, but also starts it from virtually anywhere with the drone mobile smartphone app. To start the vehicle, simply press the lock button three times on the factory key fob. You can also turn the vehicle back off by pressing the lock button three times again. That covers the operation from the OEM remotes. Stay tuned for a quick demo of the smartphone app from our friends at Drone Mobile. Hey guys, I'm Brian with the Drone Team, and in this video, I'm going to showcase the Drone Mobile 3.0 app your connected car solution. Let's get started by opening up the app. So this is our home screen, and at a glance it gives you an overview of what's going on with your vehicle. You can see the battery voltage, you can see the temperature inside your vehicle, the signal strength of the drone, and this guy right here represents what's the current status of your vehicle. And I'll demonstrate that by sending a remote start command. All right, so now your car is green, and that's gonna let you know that your engine is running, the car is started. You can also access additional commands along with unlock and lock by swiping up on the vehicle, and you'll see them here down at the bottom. You got two additional auxiliaries, a panic, and you can even pop the trunk. And now, let's track the vehicle, and you can do that by accessing the side nav here, pressing maps. The second that you do that, a command from the app is sent to your vehicle requesting the current location, and that'll be displayed here on the maps. If you have multiple vehicles, you can track all of those at the same time too. Just tap the eye icon, select which vehicles you want, and hit done. You can even change the way the map is displayed by selecting satellite mode. All right, let's move on to the activity page. You can access that from the side nav, pressing activity. And what you're seeing is a historical record over the last 90 days of all the commands sent to your drone, along with any alarm notifications, remote start commands, uh, everything, all the records are stored here. If you wanted to know more information, you can touch it and it'll display a map at where that alert or command happened along with the address. You want to know even more, maybe down to a specific date, tapping the calendar icon allows you to drill down and get more specific where you're trying to find this alert. I hope you enjoyed this basic overview of the Drone Mobile 3.0 app. If you'd like to learn more, you can check out our website at dronemobile.com. Thanks, and we look forward to keeping you connected to your car.